Hello all, welcome to 32nd Java Programming Tutorial on NetStrikers.com. My name is Aditya and in this tutorial we will learn about the file handling in Java. It is the very easy topic that you can easily understand and uh, all you need to do is just use the classes, built in classes uh, which, are, which was built by Java programmers for us. So the first thing that you need to do is import this package which is the IO package. Since the IO package contains the file class in it, so we are going to import this kind of package. So to create a file, you need to use the file class and you can create a file class object as f1 followed by the new file. You need to remember one thing that within the parameter you need to pass the file name which you want to create. For example, I want to create a file name called as Aritya Dubey which is my name .txt. Now the .txt is an extension which every file can contain or you might create another extension of type .pdf, .doc or any one like that. Now you need to remember one thing. To create a file you need to type use the file object f1 followed by create new file. That's it. It's very easy. But the create new file method in Java, Java file class throws an exception. So to capture this exception we need to first create the try catch block to handle this exception successfully and uh, it will throw an exception called as io exception. So we will handle the io exception very well io followed by io dot print stack trace. So that's how we deal with the exception of input output exception. So how we will know that our file is being created? So to know we need to first write system.out.println and this message will inform the user that your file is created. File created. Now that's it. That's how we can create a file called as adityadube.txt. Now let's run our code and check whether we are right or not. So to compile our code, you already know, you need to write java c followed by the file name java. As you can see, compilation is successful. Now let's run our code. File handling one, file created. Now you need to check on the directory on which you are working it. So I'm working in the C directory called in the folder of NetCycle. So I need to first find the aditya dube.txt file here. So as you can see, aditya dube.txt file besides is created here. Now it do not contain any message in it because we do not we didn't supply any content in it. So in our next tutorial we will learn how to create a directory. Then we will learn how to insert the text inside the file which we have created. So that's it for now. I hope you understand now. If you have any difficulties or uh, doubt, you can ask me in the YouTube comment section. I am ready to help you. Thanks for watching. Until then, enjoy your life. Bye bye.